for pre-need funerals, burials, or cremation since 1975. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, 256-245-4361. Willie Marr, Billy Jenkins Rayfield, age 90, died at her residence on December 18th. Funeral service will be on Saturday at 2 p.m. from Curtis and Son North with Pastors Glenn Winter and Brandon Baird officiating burial in the Unity Presbyterian Church Cemetery in the Unity Community. The family requests donation be made to COACH, that's Cancer Outreach and Community Hope, care of Diane Mitchell, 15019 U.S. Highway 280, Sylacauga, 35150. And also you can uh, make your donation to Coosa Valley Hospice at 315 West Hickory Street in Sylacauga, 35150. Online condolences at CurtisAndSonFH.com. Uh, Ms. Rayfield, uh, affectionately known as Sunshine. She was a, a member of uh, uh, the Coosa Valley, excuse me, uh, let me see if you're right here. I'm going to make sure I get this right. Uh, uh, the service will be on Saturday, and uh, she was a member of the church, uh, the Bethany United Methodist Church, for several years. And uh, she was a great lady from all I can uh, ascertain. That is uh, Willie Marr Billy Jenkins Rayfield, age 90, better known as Sunshine. Funeral service for Sally Holland, age 79, of Rockford. Now that service will be on Saturday at 11 a.m. from First Presbyterian Church in Sylacauga. Visitation will be tonight at Curtis and Son North from 5 until 8 p.m. The family will accept flowers or donations can be given to the Cancer Outreach and Community Hope, better known as Coach for Coosa County, or First Presbyterian Church in Sylacauga. Online condolences at CurtisAndSonFH.com. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, directing that service. Mr. Christopher S. Hauser, age 47, died December 17th, Community Funeral Home announcing. Funeral service for Rex Dean Wesson, age 75, of Childersburg. It's 2 o'clock on Saturday at Radney Smith Funeral Home Chapel, where Brother Mike Johnson officiating burial in the Evergreen Cemetery. Mr. Wesson died December 14th at Grandview Medical Center. Visitation Saturday noon until 2 at the funeral home. Memorial message can be sent to the family at RadiSmith.com, Radley Smith Funeral Home Directing. And Sharon D. Smith, age 63, died Thursday. Funeral arrangements are pending. They'll be announced by Radley Smith Funeral Home. The Reverend William F. Borden Sr., age 72, died December 18th. Community Funeral Home announcing. And funeral service for Mamie Wright Tibbs will be 2 o'clock Saturday at Morning Star uh, Church with visitation. Uh, excuse me, you can visit uh, online, terrysmortuary.com for your condolences. Terry's Metropolitan Mortuary in Talladega directing that service. That's a look at obituaries this morning brought to you by Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Silicaga, Childersburg.